Okay, full name is Jean Christopher Celestin, and I'm coming from Queens, New York. Uh, yeah, straight to TZ. <laughs> All right. yeah. uh, what brought you to Dar es Salaam, man? Uh, just Shaolin Temple, actually. Yeah, I was. Uh, I've been following Master on YouTube for like maybe six months, and it's been really inspiring. Like when I get home from work, I want to like leave the wor real world. I just go on YouTube and just check out what he's posting, and. Yeah, I've just been daydreaming about it. One, to get physically fit. And I've always loved Kung Fu movies, so I was like, uh, yeah, so I came down here to train, and it's been an amazing time. Yeah. Okay, so uh, what are the, some of the perceptions that you think North America has about mm -hmm. Africa? Yeah. And uh, what did you see coming here? Yeah, uh, I think, I guess North America, the general perception is that everyone in Africa is poor and hungry and have absolutely no money or just begging for food. And when I came here, I saw professionals like Zuberi, master, he has a craft that's his own and it's pretty original considering, I guess, the rest of the culture, you can say. So, yeah, I respect them a lot and I think that there are a lot of people here in Africa and Tanzania specifically who live like any other person in Europe or North America, so. Yeah, it was cool to see that. All right. Yeah. Um, so if there are three lessons that you can take back home when you leave, okay. what do you think those three lessons are? Three lessons, okay. Uh, first lesson is I rely way too much on like electronic appliances, like <laughs> Wi-Fi and dishwashers and uh, like just washing my clothes and stuff so it's made me really be conscious of how I use my time and how I could be more responsible with yeah just be more responsible I guess yeah <laughs> second lesson would be exercise is everything and at home I'm not so physically active because I don't make the time because of work and it's really an excuse 24 hours in a day and I've really learned how to wake up early and just dedicate myself to training my body. So I definitely will take that home with me. And third lesson I guess would be Kung Fu is everything and everything is Kung Fu. So I've been able to apply Kung Fu to all aspects of my life, spiritually, physically, mentally. So I'll be going home with that as well. Yeah, thank you, thank you, thank you. It's been an honor to work with you guys too. It's been cool. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Yeah.